Oops. Poder means to be allowed to. To be allowed to, to do something, of course, if you want to do something and you want to ask if you're allowed to do something or maybe you're not and you just want to know or you want to say you, you're not allowed to do <laughs> certain thing, you can use poder for that situation as well in, in that kind of situation. For example, no se puede fumar en el centro comercial. No se puede fumar en el centro comercial. So this means you're not allowed to smoke at the mall. Essentially, you're saying you can't sm uh, smoke here at the mall. That's technically what you're saying, but it, it's very similar to saying to, you know, you're not allowed to smoke at the mall. So very, very similar. The other verb that is very similar to this is permitir, okay? No se permite fumar en el centro comercial. I'm just going to put it here. No se permite. No se permite, okay? So it's very similar. You can also say no se puede, no se puede. And um, man, let's break this down. Let's see how it works. No, no se puede. No se puede means uh, you're not allowed to do something. No se puede. You're not allowed or... Uh, it has also a different meaning. No se puede. It's not possible. It's similar to saying it's not possible uh, or you can't. Okay. It depends on the situation. What do you want to say? Right. It depends on that. But if you say no se puede, it's like saying you're not allowed to do something. In this situation, fumar. Fumar. If you add a verb right after no se puede, you need the verb in the infinitive form. So don't conjugate it. You leave the AR ending or ER, IR, the famous endings, <laughs> verb endings in Spanish. So don't conjugate it. No se puede fumar. You're not allowed to smoke. Okay, fumar means to smoke. Yo fumo. Tu fumas, el fuma, fumamos, fumé, okay? So let me tell you, fumar is a regular verb, okay? So it's not a complicated verb. It means to smoke, fumar, <laughs> okay? Just as smoking, okay? We're not talking about any other kind of smoke. It's just about the, just smoking. Okay. No se puede fumar. You're not allowed to smoke. En, en means a lot of things. It means in, on, at. Okay. So it's a very, very versatile <laughs> little word. Uh, so just remember that. If you're talking about places, then it means at. Okay. El centro comercial. The mall. El, the, centro comercial means mall. <laughs> it's a very long term. Centro comercial. Mall. Okay. No se puede fumar en el centro comercial. You're not allowed to smoke at the mall. Now, let's look at the next example. ¿Podemos tocar las estatuas? ¿Podemos tocar, tocar las estatuas? This is a question, of course, and it means are we allowed to touch the statues? Okay, so it's also very similar to saying can we touch the statues? Okay, <laughs> very similar to saying that. But it's also a way to ask if you're allowed to do something. In this situation, 
you want to touch the statues and you just want to make sure it's possible. It's allowed. Okay. Podemos. Podemos. Nosotros podemos. We don't need nosotros. Usually when you ask a question in Spanish, you do not need personal pronouns. So if you say puedo, puedo cantar, can I sing? You don't need yo. Yo puedo cantar. You don't need to say no. It sounds a bit weird if you, if you ask like that. So just drop the personal pronouns, yo, tú, él, nosotros, ustedes, ellos, and just use the verb first in the situation podemos, which is the verb that we're learning right now, means are we allowed to, to do something, okay? In this situation, tocar, tocar means to touch, okay? Also, it means to play an instrument, if you play the drums, for example, yo toco la batería, I play the drums, okay? But tocar also means to touch, touch. Las, the, estatuas, estatuas, that's a very good word to pronounce, it's a, a fun word to pronounce and it means statues. Statues. Oops. Podemos tocar las estatuas. Are we allowed to touch the statues? Okay. So just remember that it's very simple. Poder is very similar to to be allowed to do something. It's good if you want to ask if you're allowed to do X thing, or if you want to say you can't do this here. <laughs> it's not allowed. No se puede fumar en el centro comercial. You're not allowed to smoke at the mall. <laughs> okay, so that's that's very good. That's very good. I like the meaning of poder uh, when it means to be allowed to. It's a very good verb. Poder is, <laughs> it has so many meanings, definitely. Definitely. <laughs>